Okay, fine. Now, what happened? Uh, like this is a two steps, two stages we are built. Like as one is for what? Get the source code. Another one is what? Have and build. Okay. This is for this is the pipeline and this name is where I mentioned. This is the inside my global tool configuration of my Maven home path. I guess that name which I will give right that name. For example, if you give that and see that name is naming convention, like it should be the same is as you given the global tool configuration. This is a tool name. This is a mandatory. If you give any name here, it won't work. Okay, even cabinet name also it won't work. Okay. Clear then this is that this is like this code I generated using the snippet generator. Then next using the build, I just using the which command SH MVN package. MVN package means what will do? It will be what are the stages will be do this? It will do validate, compile, test, and packaging things. And clean also will do the automatically. Right? These are the stages we are going to be indicated as of now. Just apply save it and I click the build now button. This is how we generate the snippet, right? That I'll show here snippet how to generate here. This is the one. Which URL we passed, then I pass the credentials. I click the generate the snippet and it will be generate this. Just I copy this code and I paste it here. This credentials ID where I configure means in the global tool, uh, like as credentials, right? Global credentials. There I when I created my GitHub credentials, I adding credentials. I given that username, password, ID, right? That ID is this. Okay, that ID is this. Okay, by default, if you select here, it, it will take that whatever the ID you are specified, that name it will take. Okay, ID is different, description is different. Okay, I don't think that. Here it will show in the box is the description. Okay, this box is showing the description, but in the Jenkins uh, credentials place, we configure into the that ID. If you guys want, I show here also. Let's see, go to credentials here. And see my GitHub credentials. Let's go for update here. Right here, this ID. Okay, this ID of this ID are both the same. Clear now that ID. Fine. I click the build now. Let's see the console output. Right now, what will happen? This Maven package will build this step, and then it's will succeed it, and then where it will be stored this my web file. Under this, it will be stored my web file where lib Jenkins workspace and GitHub Jen Jenkins Maven target pipeline and target folder, and this this web file will be generated for this. And the next must next stage is what I want to I want to deploy to the Tomcat where the Tomcat is running. That Tomcat is running on the another server of my EC2 itself. Okay. Let's take this is the instance. This is the instance. Okay. And here my Tomcat is running. Credentials of this. Okay, now here I am going to deploy this. See, here is the this are the application is running currently. Now this is in the morning I deployed. I am going to undeploy this. Okay, I like guess morning. This don't confuse the pipeline. Uh, that project right. That's why I I deploy this. Okay. Okay. Now there is no any pipeline script file I deployed as of now. Okay, I am going to do through pipeline code now. Fine. Then what we need to do? Let me write the code for to deploy the Tomcat also. Okay. Let's go here. And how we are going to deploy? We are going to deploy this into the using the curl command. Okay. You can use for the curl command. You can deploy it here. Okay. This is the command I use for this. Okay. Now here you can use the curl and I guess this is the verbose and this username. This is a username colon password. Like for example, you don't want to expose the username password. I'll tell you that other step. As of now, I'm going to show the username password here. How to specify this? Instead of specifying this, even we are going to be hiding this credentials also. That would be very good practice. I'll show that. Okay, this way the my path of Marple is located. This is we need to be added here. 
okay let me take this line this source and destination thus another place is what this is my source where file is located and then where i need to apply this is my tomcat is where is running the tomcat the tomcat url and then this is for 8080 of this manager text deploy path this is for context path which we are going to deploy now uh, basically this name is your wish whatever we want to give the context path that context path is deployed into the target that i am going to do this now okay let's let's write a new stage here one more stage back to the project configure here here i am going to write the one more stage here this stage is for steps and this is for stage and inside this i need to write the another one more stage another stage what stage of stage of i'm going to one other stage i'm going to deploy that is for deployment stage okay this is deployment stage and again inside this i'm going to use for the steps inside steps i'm going to use this url and here i need to use for which is let me go for jenkins here i'm going to open this path of where we are going to be store our artifact storing this is a path path of our wireframe okay this path we need to go here from here to this place okay the destination is what this http and this url which where where tomcat is running take this url open this and then this where we are we this url we need to be configured here okay now this should be two slashes two slashes of single slash it will work okay the next manager and then text this is a url for where we are going to deploy through text deploy through text deploy means this event we can deploy through here right through deploy right this is the url i'm going to take it out for deploying this if you want to deploy like there we are going to deploy right like that also we are going to be deploy choose file where to deploy right this is a text deployment okay now we are going to through deploy through the curl command okay now for that what the syntax we are going to use in the manager url and text deploy and this context path is what that you are wish whatever you want you can do this now let's say i guess spring the name whatever you want you can do this context path this context path only to show in the tomcat spring maven okay let's say spring maven or else or else we can do the spring pipeline okay now these steps i have written here and then inside the stage and step step will be closed here stage will be closed here this is the stages will be closed here and this is the pipeline will be closed here okay now let's see here apply save it apply save it and go to the build no matter what is the drawback here in this script we are exposing the username password right that is not a way we are doing in the real time okay now this is deployed and go to see here there is no spring pipeline project as of now yet just refresh this no we deployed this application we deployed this application right through that we are going to deploy this find that cool but this is a not a good practice okay this is not at all a good practice to expose the username and passwords in the pipeline but what i need to do i need to be make it a no one can't see my username passwords then how can i make it got it guys what i'm saying now here i'm providing the username password for here exposing right now i don't want to show this username password here 
I want to like as I don't want to show here, but I need to use for credentials here. How? Even these credentials we need to add into the credentials and that here that there is a, some script we need to use here. We'll see that. That's clear now as of now. There is a three stages. I just get URL and then Maven. Like yesterday we have done right echo statements. Here one echo statement, here we are echo, one echo statement and here one echo statement. Instead of echo statements, what we done here today? We are going to define the our actual where we are going to deploy application. I guess Maven git and tomorrow what we'll do? One email notification. Then day after tomorrow, what we'll do? We are going to do with the like as Nexus also. Okay. From Nexus, we are going to deploy into the Tomcat. Just step again. Clear guys?